Um, I feel really bad because I have a lot of subscribers that subscribe to me because of my hair loss journey and I have not done a hair video in a long time. It's hard for me, but then I realized that I know that you guys need this. I know that it's important for me to be able to share with um, other people who are going through this with me because what's the point of being on earth if you can't share and communicate and create relationships and I just I just feel like this is what I'm supposed to be doing okay so um, first I wanted to start off by telling you the shampoo and conditioner that I use oh by the way if you guys are new to my channel welcome my name is Joanne I hope that you would click the subscribe button and um, join me I I do have a hair loss journey, but I'm also a mom, and I like to do mom lifestyle videos, and we just recently purchased a house, so I will be doing some home renovation videos as well, and you can always click on my channel and view um, those videos to catch up on things. So anyway, so the item, the products that I use is uh, right now that I've really been loving is the Redken line. And these, I got at Ulta, buy two, get one free. And so, or no, buy two, get two free, sorry. And so I got the Redken All Soft Shampoo and Conditioner. And I love them. They work for me. I've noticed less fallout. Yeah, that's really awesome. Some shampoos, I guess they're too harsh and it makes my roots too soft and it makes them like makes the hair come right out and I guess I just get like clumps of hair in the shower drain oh god it's so bad and what really makes me sad is when I see those new little tiny baby hairs that were growing that fall out that really makes me sad the long hairs falling out doesn't bother me it's the little tiny short ones that were just growing that makes me want to just you know it's very depressing um, so anyway, these have a protein complex in them and I really love them. So, um, give it a shot. I love it because it makes my hair very, very soft. And lately, um, because I'm going through menopause, I noticed that my new hairs are growing in more wiry and, um, brittle and dry. And that has definitely helped me. The other thing that I use, um, that... I love that goes along with that line is the and these are kind of still wet I just got out of the shower um, the extreme anti snap actually this I this is wet because there was other stuff in the shower that I put in here and this got wet but this does not stay in my shower this is on my in my drawer in my bathroom and um, this is the extreme anti snap it's an anti break leave-in treatment and I absolutely love this. I've already used it, but I just want to show you. It comes in a little pump and it has a lock on it, so you unlock it. I like to lock and unlock it because if you don't, it'll dry up and get like um, like a plasticky dried up film. So I unlock it and then, there we go. And then I just do like a little bit like that. Oh man. It smells so good. That's like one of my favorite things about it. Um, so I've already put it in my hair, but I just rub it on my hands and all on my fingertips too. And I just get it all in there and I go from root to tip. And my hair, I, I, I towel dry my hair first and try to get as much water out as I can. And then while my hair is still kind of wet, I put it in. But you can also put it in after you've already dried your hair um, for like an extra, you know, just to, to suck up. If you have like some hair that's really dry and needs to suck up some moisture, put it on while your hair is dry. So these two items and then I got two of these. So these were like buy two, get two free. So um, I can't remember how much these cost. I want to say they were like $16 a bottle. So I got four bottles for $32, which makes it like $8 a bottle. Um, and that was just a deal that they had going on at Ulta. So um, I will link those in 
Amazon. I'll see if I can find a sale. If not, I will go, if I can't find a sale, I'm going to go ahead and link it anyway. Um, and then that way at least you can look at it and read the ingredients and, you know, see for yourself if you'd like it. Um, I absolutely love it. And then also I will link the Ulta website as well. Ulta doesn't have it on sale right now, but they always have sales coming and going. So the next item that I want to show you that I use is my facial cleanser. So I use two different facial cleansers. I use a Hydro Booster by Neutrogena, and then I also use the Equate brand of a moisturizing cleanser that's very much like CeraVe. So this one is like a gel, and it foams up, and it makes a, a wonderful, soft, foamy bubbles when I wash. And this is, um, I, as you can see, I've used a lot of it. I bought it when it had first hit the market, when it first hit the shelves, and I was like, all right, I'm going to try this. It smells amazing. It has hyaluronic acid in it, um, which keeps your skin soft. It, like, keeps the moisture into your skin. And it keeps my skin very, very soft and very supple, which that is a big bonus for me. I love that because I have very dry skin. But also, if I've been wearing my makeup for too long and I start to break out, this will get all the impurities out of my pores and really give me a nice, fresh, clean start. So that's the Neutrogena Hydro, Hydro Boost Hydrating Cleansing Gel. Absolutely love it. Highly recommend it. I love that it has like a little pump. That's awesome. Anything that has a pump is good. I love that. I don't like pouring things in. Okay, so this one is also a cleanser, but it's a creamy cleanser, and this compares to the CeraVe. This is the Walmart brand. I like CeraVe, but if I can get the Walmart brand for, you know, half the price, I'm going to do that, and that's what I do with this, and I absolutely love this. So let me just show you what it looks like. Um, it's just a, I guess I should have showed you the gel one too, but it's just a, a creamy cleanser, and it doesn't bubble. And this is really good for taking off makeup. So a lot of times I only use this one. And then I use the Neutrogena Hydro Boost for if I need a little additional cleansing. So let me get a wipe. Wipe that off. So those are the two cleansers that I use. And then for a facial moisturizer, I like to use... Again, Equate brand, which is the Walmart brand. This is a, a, also comparing to the CeraVe. I think that these two come hand in hand. Um, this one I'm actually almost out of because I love it so much that I was putting it on my entire body. Like, I really love it. Um, this is the Equate Beauty compared to CeraVe Moisturizing Lotion with ceramides and hyaluronic acid. It helps to replenish your skin's moisture barrier. It's for normal to dry skin and it's fragrance free. That's a big thing. When you look for cleansers and moisturizers, you want to do fragrance free. Um, this one here is paraben free, but I, which is paraben is like a cancer causing agent. Um, I don't know all the details. I just know that it's, you know, it's good to get paraben, paraben free, but fragrance, I can't remember if this has fragrance in it. I don't think it does, but if it does, it's very, very minimal. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, definitely. I love this. And then this one, I, this one does have a fragrance in it, but it is very minimal. Like there's no like real big smell to it. Actually, here, I'm going to go ahead and do a sample of this, too, just so you can see. It's just a clear gel. It does have a refreshing, fresh soap smell to it, but it's it's not overpowering. It's, it's a very nice, pleasant, pretty smell. And it's a very neutral smell. Like, if I was a guy, I, would, I could use that and get away with it, and no one's going to say, oh, you smell like a, a flower, you know? <laughs> um, it's just very fresh. So anyway, this moisturizing lotion is amazing. This is for um, normal to dry skin. I have very sensitive skin, and I absolutely love this because it's here's what it looks like. It's not too thick, very, very thin and creamy and soft and smooth. I love it. I just put it on my face, but I'm going to go ahead and do it again. I definitely 
put moisturizer on my neck and my delicate, delic, delic, I can't say it. My chest, delicate, decolette, decolette. I'm not sure how to pronounce it, um, but you, you get what I'm saying. So anyway, this moisturizing is nice because it's not too thick. It's not watery. It just goes on so buttery smooth and your skin just absorbs it very nicely. So I absolutely highly recommend the Walmart brand of the CeraVe lotion. So if you don't have, if you don't want to go to Walmart or order it on Walmart, then um, you can get the CeraVe brand and it's just fine. So the next item that I really love to use is the Aveeno brand. Aveeno is also um, fragrance free. You can get the fragrance free kind and it's made with oats and other items, you know, other things. But this one here has a fragrance in it. I got this on clearance at Target and um, at first I really didn't like it because I thought that the scent was too harsh. And it was because I was so used to using a fragrance free moisturizer and cleanser. So this is a body wash. This is a moisturizer. Trying not to confuse you, but they are both a Vino brand. So this is the body wash, and the body wash does have fragrance in it in this particular one. They do have a fragrance-free option. Um, they have several options, really, but I like this because it's very soothing, it cleans my skin perfectly, and it's very, re it's very relieving for if you have dry and itchy skin, which is what I get a lot. Um, so this I, is just a little sample, but I have, somebody gave, my neighbor actually gave me a whole bunch of these samples, and so I'm using this up, but I, until I can, you know, when I'm done with it, then I'll go and get the full size, but this is a daily moisturizing lotion, it has dimethicone in it, and it is fragrance free, and it really does keep your skin moisturized for a whole entire day. I love it. Um, this has zero fragrance in it. It's a little bit thicker and it feels kind of slimy compared to the moisturizing lotion that is the the Walmart CeraVe. The, it's the Walmart brand of CeraVe moisturizing lotion. Um, this one feels kind of like almost slimy-ish. That's the only thing I don't like about it. Um, only when I compare the two but if I only had just this by itself, I, I don't really notice a difference, to be honest. But if you don't like um, a wet, slimy feel, then I wouldn't get the Aveeno. If you just want your skin to be moisturized, but you don't want that, like, I feel like I have lotion on my skin feel, then go with the CeraVe um, imitation Walmart brand moisturizing lotion. <laughs> okay. Another item that I like to use as a moisturizing lotion is the Uracin Skin Calming uh, Oatmeal Enriched Cream. This is also fragrance free and it is for dry, itchy skin. And I love to use this on my feet. It's very thick, but when you put it on, it feels like you're putting nothing on. It's I feel like it has a light feel to it, um, but it kind of has like a rich feel to it as well. I, I guess it's like an, um, a mixture. It's like in between the two. So yeah, that's another product that I really love and um, yeah, that I've been loving a lot lately. And even though it's fragrance free, I still smell something really nice and pleasant in it. I'm not sure what it is. It kind of smells almost like a baby powder. Another item that I use is a Lady Speed Stick Invisible Dry Deodorant Antiperspirant, and I use this rarely. I honestly don't use deodorant that often. I feel like I don't really need to. Um, I just can do like one little swipe, you know, one, one, and done. And this is from the Dollar Tree, and it was so it was a dollar, and um, I barely use it, so. Yeah, and this is the Shower Fresh. I like it. It works. It really works. But I'm not like a sweater. I'm not a person that gets uh, really stinky very easy. I mean, I take showers every day, so I don't have to, <laughs> you know, it. I just, I don't really sweat that often. But 
yeah, I like it. And also, it doesn't rub onto my clothing. That's, yeah, that's I love. Um, I also use Crest 3D White Luxe Fluoride Anti-Cavity Toothpaste, the Diamond Strong. And this one is amazing. I love how it smells. It's just a nice minty. I like how it tastes. And it's a white paste. Very, very minty and refreshing, but it's not like overpowering. And I really like how it makes my teeth like shiny. You know, it makes them really shiny and white. So yeah, I like that. And it's supposed to strengthen your enamel. And so yes, everybody needs that. I especially need it. I have very frail bones. Um, yeah, so the next item, I'm going to put some on right now, that I absolutely love is Blistex Complete Moisture with SPF 15 in it. And I've actually used this on my entire face before and I didn't break out. I was actually kind of surprised, but this is really nice because it's like you, it has like a minty taste to it. And like I said, I've used it on my face. Um, one time I didn't um, have sunscreen with me and I knew I was going to be out in the sun. So I put it on and I was pleasantly surprised at how well it worked. So yeah, those are the products that I love and that I have been really happy with and that I use on a regular basis. So go ahead and go into the links in the description box and click on the links and it'll take you to those items. You can read the ingredients. If you have dry and sensitive skin like me, let me know in the comments down below what products work for you. I'd really love to know. I always like to try new things. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.